Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to showing you how to get the Minecraft Bedrock Edition Editor. So this is an official Minecraft feature that has just been released in the latest Minecraft preview. And using it, you can actually place down massive amounts of blocks, copy and paste different selections, and use a whole lot more tools in your Minecraft Bedrock Edition world. And so if you like my videos like this one, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft tutorials in the future. So this video will focus only on how to actually get into the editor currently and not in everything you can do with it. I might make a video on that later on, but that is too much to cover in just this video. And so currently the Minecraft Bug Edition editor is only available on PC and only available for the latest preview. This means you need to have the latest preview installed on your Minecraft Bug Edition on PC. And so currently that's Minecraft Preview 1.19.80.20. But if you don't know how to install Minecraft Preview on PC, then just check out the tutorial I've made on it. Link to that is in the top right of your screen. Go watch it first if you don't have the preview yet, and then come back here to see how to get to the Bedrock Editor. But all right, now we're on the same page. Let's just get started. So what you need to do is first close out of Minecraft Preview. Then next, what you want to do is head over to your desktop and then just right click, go over to new and then shortcut like this. And then in here, what item would you like to create a shortcut for? And you'll have to enter the following. So it's going to be Minecraft colon question mark editor equals true. So I'll put this in the description as well. Make sure you have your capitalization correctly because it is case sensitive and make sure yeah, that pretty much everything is correct here. And then you can just click next. And then here you can give it a name, for example, just Minecraft Bedrock Editor like this and click finish. And so it might be that you'll see a Minecraft logo here. I currently do not see a Minecraft logo here, but that doesn't need to be an issue because after you've started up the Minecraft Bugger Edition Editor once, it'll automatically get this nice logo over here of the Minecraft preview. Next up, just double click this Minecraft Bedrock Editor. And here we go, we'll see Minecraft and Minecraft Preview. You'll select Minecraft Preview right here and just press always. And this launches Minecraft Preview with the editor. And so you know you've done this correctly if it says create a new project. So we can just click that. And then right here, we are now in the Minecraft Bedrock Edition Editor. We can give this project a name and set our different settings in here as well if we wanted to and then just click create. And so you will see this screen right here. Welcome to Minecraft Editor. Minecraft Editor is a multi-block editing experience that helps you easily craft high quality worlds in Minecraft Bedrock. We are early in development and excited by the opportunity to build alongside our creator community. Click through the tabs above to learn the basics. Yeah, and so this screen over here is gonna be your best friend if you wanna get started on how to use the Minecraft Bedrock Edition editor. So there's information on movement on how to move here. And then there's how to select parts. Then there is the tools as well, which are on the left over here. There is the paste preview and also the brush tool. There are some actions in the top left over here as well. And then there's further help here as well. With more documentation, you can click this and you'll get to a web page where you can get more information on how to use the Better Condition Editor. We can just click this away. And here we see ourselves as well. So we can select certain parts, use the brush tool. And for example, make it hollow. And there we go, we can just place blocks wherever we want. Oh, that's a lot of blocks. And so yeah, you can just move with your WASD as normal and you can actually just, well, pretty much go through blocks like you're in spectator mode. It's currently a bit difficult to control, but I assume they will make some changes to that in the future. So you can make this brush also massive. Then just place massive blocks of stone all over the place. Just like that. And another important part is toggling between modes, which you will definitely need, so... Just use control tab to switch between this editing mode and just regular Minecraft mode where we can just fly around like normal and you're actually in spectator mode so you can just fly through blocks and see everything below as well. And then once you want to go back to editing just hold control and press tab and there we go we're back in the editing mode. And if you want to export your world of course just file export and then export as a playable world. And so yeah that's pretty much how far I'm going to go for now because I'm also not too familiar with this just yet. As you can see you can do crazy things with this tool though. So if you have any more questions on how to get the Better Condition Editor, then please leave them in the comments down below. And if you like this video, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft tutorials in the future. And so there we go. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope to see you all in the next one. So until then, bye-bye.